first time you open the script editor and try to run some code that's going to manipulate your spreadsheet, you're going to run into some issues. Uh, we can actually get around those, but let's just take a walkthrough of what's going to happen. So if we call spreadsheet app dot get active sheet dot get range, we'll just say a one dot set value. The first time we try to do this, if we we'll go ahead and save our project. Uh, save the code, but if we run my function, we're gonna get a we're gonna get this message. It says authorization required. Uh, we need to just give it access to our spreadsheet. So we click review permissions, and it's gonna ask you to sign in. Go ahead and select your name, and you're gonna see this message. This app isn't verified, and it's gonna say back to safety. And it doesn't look like there's any way to actually get through this. Uh, what you actually have to do is go to advanced. And it's going to say Google hasn't reviewed this app yet and can't confirm it's authentic. Well, that's because we actually literally just wrote it. So Google hasn't taken a look at it. We haven't submitted it for verification or anything like that. So we click go to untitled project unsafe. And it's going to say it's going to want to deal with your spreadsheets. And we're writing code to deal with our spreadsheets. So that makes perfect sense. So we click allow. And once we do that, we should be OK to run our function. And as you can see, if we go back to our spreadsheet we get something and that ran and that does exactly what we want and if we run again if we go to B1 and we save this and we run it now we'll see that we actually don't have to run that authorization again it's just gonna set that value this time the first time we don't have to do it again but it's important to know that the first time you run any of your script projects you're gonna have to go through that authorization step so just make sure you click that advanced link at the bottom and make sure you allow your spread your script to run within your spreadsheet that's all for now. Thanks for watching.